preparing our two serves here. Wes is practicing the slider, trying to get that out right. So basically, um, working on two sides of the court here. Wes is playing on synthetic tomorrow. So on synthetic, if it's a wet court, especially if it's been raining a lot in Melbourne, that will actually skid and give you extra distance. But Tom is playing on a clay court, so you won't get that extra skid, but the kick is what you really need to uh, make sure you stay consistent in the game. You know, a heavy kick on the second serve, uh, and wind it up with some ground strokes and you'll go much better on clay. On synthetic, it's sort of not an official surface so you can get away with anything. If you have a good slice here, our cone is there. If you get away with a nice slider, it will just skid away from the opponent and it's just... Yeah, it's over. When you get a slider that, uh, like, that good like Djokovic or uh, Murray, then Points basically over on synthetic, it's, it's like a cheat surf. That's why it's such a good surf to practice because once you perfect it, it's sort of um, an ace every time. Or it's a big change up. So you rise the fence, especially when you, if you're playing on an indoor court, you always have these boundaries between the courts. And those angled serves would just get you three points every time. I'm starting to go more down the tee. You can see we're practicing some the opposite, you're sliding down the tee. It's, so your idea from this one is to sort of hit uh, the right of the court here for the, on the, uh, the ad side and then smooth its way. If we look at the goals on the other side of the court, if we can hit the middle of the goals and maybe to the left, we can hit a good slider. Otherwise, if it goes too straight, maybe like that one, it will go sort of into their forehand and it won't work. So you need to work it away from them. That's how you really uh, increase these angles for your serve and really get some cheap points.